Hello everyone, my name is Ankit and welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna talk about this famous text effect that Beautiful Destinations and the Sam Calder uses this. And we're gonna create this in Premiere Pro right now. So uh, let's start it. First of all, go to the panel and right click and go to new item and go to title and click OK. And write any text you want. So for example, my year 2017 and then you select this and select any text you want I'm selecting right now a Roboto and then increase the size to about 200 and then go to the positions align the positions of the horizontal and vertical center and then click OK and rename this to text and just drag this onto here and maybe a half position would good to go and then right click again go to the title here type in forward slash select this maybe anything would do I'll select the parchment and then select the size as 200 maybe more than that 220 and then same thing this position horizontal center and vertical center click ok and rename this to over text and just drag it here and now what you do is you go to the transform effect here and just drag the transform on, on both the layers you're just going to adjust the positions and go to the uniform scale and click it and just like it like the way you want yeah that's it that looks good and then go to the duh, and go to this text layer and again uniform scale and maybe up to 65% or maybe 70% looks good yeah that's good and now what you're gonna do is go to the crop effect apply the crop effect onto the text layer and just drag this onto the text layer go to this over text layer and just position it accordingly for example we're gonna start it from here and now go to the text layer and here go to the crop effect now in this just make it disappear what are the text you have written just to the point yeah up to 69 so now we can see that the text goes invisible now we can animate this go to the over layer and and click on the toggle animation create a key point and now just go to here and again click the key point keyframe sorry and just go to the text effect and just disable this yeah up to this point go ahead and create a key point here as well just create this and again just drag it a little bit further yeah that's it now you can see that you're getting the cool transition effect but the text down is not disappearing so we're gonna make the text disappear right about this point so we're gonna create the keyframe here you're gonna create the key point again and we're gonna change the point when it gets appear now you can see that we have created this cool effect see that okay and now what you're gonna do is we're gonna nest this up and we're gonna copy paste this onto this and reverse the speed so we'll get the full effect now now you'll see that 
that's it so i hope you like this tutorial and if you want to give me any suggestions you can mention in the comment below and i'll make a tutorial on that as well so till then take care bye bye see you